Hi vibes everyone. I am uh, taking a walk in the forest and uh, well I'm guided by spirit to uh, share with you some of uh, the insights and some of uh, the way I perceive reality in this now. Uh, also taking in account what is taking place uh, uh, in the scenes around the planet. Uh, today we have uh, the emergency alert system uh, a test is uh, taking place in UK. So um, it is my sense, my feeling that uh, we are moving forward into, into more uh, tangible uh, action uh, on the uh, global scene. Um, what is it I know? I, I don't know exactly when these events are going to happen and how this is going to happen. Nobody knows. This is uh, the plan happening in, uh, in front of our eyes. And yet what I want to tell you is that uh, uh, these events are depending on many countries. One of them is Israel, what's taking place there. And uh, I believe that Palestine is going to start uh, also um, taking back what, is, what belongs to them. And then uh, there is going to be a movement taking place. Uh, there is like uh, 17 countries, alliance, that uh, are going to be led by uh, General Michael Flynn to completely uh, dismantle uh, the old, completely dismantle what is uh, no longer there. And I, I have the sense and the feeling that the emergency alert system will be for that. Uh, it will be just for... Uh, letting the people know to uh, I don't know if it's gonna be in all countries I feel it's gonna be not globally I feel it's gonna be more uh, in a few countries uh, more than 50% globally maybe more we'll see how this is working how this is taking place and uh, and uh, well uh, this is gonna be like a what I feel is going to be short, not going to be too long, yet uh, um, everybody needs to, those, those, of, those who are not read, really yet uh, awakened need to see some things, uh, it's going to be broadcast on, on media, on the mainstream media, uh, and, uh, and yes, there's going to be like some kind of fear vibrations being created through that, which... Uh, I invite you to not focus on it, just uh, get on uh, with our lives and uh, focus on feeling good every now. Be more in nature and connect with elements and the higher dimensions and, uh, and I invite you to do this sacred work, to go within and work with the angelics and uh, Mother, Father, God. This is how this works and as you know, when we do this work, then uh, when we connect the higher self, then we create our own realities. So uh, this cannot affect us in a personal level, yet uh, what you will perceive out there, especially those that are still engaged in this way of uh, uh, beingness on the planet, uh, like being uh, affected by the external, instead of uh, doing the work from within out, um, well, yes, we will witness some uh, some negativity still taking place. It's going to be very reactive. Um, at the same time, we that we are doing the work, we are sending the energies out, the energies of the Violet Flame, uh, with Saint Germain and all the angels, angels of the Violet Flame, and the dragons that are assisting us. All these I'm sharing with you are real. They are, these are real light, be light beings, very powerful energies that as we invite them and think of them, dragons, they don't have uh, free will. We need to, to invite them with love and to command them to do the work. So I'm working a lot with them. I'm working a lot with unicorns. I have a personal unicorn I'm working on. I'm working a lot with my elemental and my angel of abundance. You all, all of them have, have each one of those that I described and uh, it's up to you to work with them directly and ask them and command them with love. People are passing by, running. 
<laughs> so um, I invite you to uh, to um, uh, work with them directly and uh, create your own reality for yourselves. Uh, this is how this goes. Uh, and yet uh, the outside will be more or less of what I'm describing here. Why? Simply because, as you know, uh, it's my sense, it's my perspective, seen from a, a global awareness and perceived from a global awareness what's taking place. Because we, a certain uh, percentage or maybe all of us on the planet, we are all, we are all angels basically. That's what Archangel Michael says, we are all angels. All of us being on the, on the planet right now, all of us angels, whether we know it or not. And uh, our lineage is from the Seraphim, from the Archangelic, from Metatron. Everybody has uh, this uh, lineage. That's where we come from. And yes, see from what perspective we are going back there. We're going back to this, to this life of fifth dimensional life of uh, living and experiencing love and kindness from each other. And yet where we are right now is this. This is uh, the third dimensional uh, reality still playing, playing out in front of us. I don't know if this is gonna go, gonna leave us. I, I think that it's gonna still be around for a while. We're still gonna be able to observe it around us at some point. Uh, this is, this is how, how it works. Otherwise, three-dimensional uh, existence and the physical, uh, it will still be around us for quite some time. We choose to live in, in 5D and beyond. We are more than that, not just 5D. We are multidimensional beings, so every moment is, uh, can be uh, focused on, on, the, on the dimensions, on the multidimensional level we are. Uh, in this now moment, I'm focusing a lot on the 10th dimension, that is the frequency of uh, abundance and prosperity, and frequency of opulence, and uh, the gold frequency of uh, creating financial freedom. This is something that I really like to work on for myself and for the planet. So uh, this is also something else to, to think and to feel into. And yes, let's go back to the third dimensional uh, things that are happening right now on the planet. In my sense, uh, even though um, I can dramatically say it many times that um, we um, um, if we want to think in godly ways, then we need to be able to forgive and to, uh, to let go and uh, to be free. Yes, yet many of you know what already happened to the place for thousands of years, including uh, uh, children that have been kidnapped, us in our other lives that have been killed maybe, and many other stories and traumatic experiences that we have been through. And as I'm walking here, I was like, wow, man, look at this. I mean, we have, we have gone through all that. We have gone through all these traumatic experiences and cleaning all that, layer, layer after layer. And this is so deep and it's so intense. And, and uh, by cleaning, out, cleaning it, we become basically aware that, as a friend was saying to me two days ago, hey, man, we are source. We are source. I'm source. And he was speaking to me and we were laughing together, you know, and uh, he's a very good friend. And, uh, and that's who we really are. We are really source. We are source. It's just like, like we, are, we are part of a source. We are source. We are the universe itself. Each one, of, each one of us amongst us. And each one of us amongst us also is, is an extension of source. Yes? So we are here to to uh, expand uh, as source and to, to create um, the new reality as expansion of source. So, um, so uh, this is happening joyfully within when you focus on this energy and this is how you create reality. So, uh, so what I want to say is that uh, again back to the third dimensional uh, things that are occurring now on the planet it's like, do your best to, okay, be aware, see it as a movie occurring, and, uh, and uh, be grateful of what's taking place, uh, because even this, 
uh, whatever is occurring is helping us to to um, the contrast is helping us more to to create more of what we really want so the anger the fear whatever emotional states we're experiencing ourselves or, or anybody else or the collective we can transmit it through the violet flame and and create the new the new freedom of abundance of prosperity of love of kindness this we can do this is a very powerful uh, way to use these emotions and the human species we are very specialized in uh, in this uh, the human species uh, we are the most powerful in the, the in the galaxies of uh, of uh, being able to use our emotions so uh, this is something that we have been training for for thousands of years and uh, we are recognized as as this species on the galaxies from our galactic brothers and sisters and what i'm sharing here with you will you will uh, understand more maybe when when our galactic brothers and sisters start to visiting us and exchanging with, with them information exchange of information is already happening on uh, on um, uh, on uh, on a telepathic level so very often i have uh, um, things I'm working and playing with and then the Arcturians spread messages uh, through Daniel's crowd on exactly what I'm doing so then I know that I don't even have to read this message anymore I'm just uh, I'm just there already and yet uh, they are also learning from us and then through channels on the planet they're sharing the information and then more people can hear it and more people like myself uh, can can read the confirmation and oh yeah this is it this is what i'm doing and it confirms what i say that they are learning from us and basically they are giving back to us from the experiences from those of us that it works they're giving back to us information on how can we make this happen yet i always say guys if you really want to uh, do the work the guru is inside of you and each one of you amongst you you uh, have the ability to find what is working best for you and do the work and um, find this this ways and and the message will come very clear to you what is the best way to uh, to uh, uh, live your life in your own terms and to and to uh, listen to the voice within and to and allow joy to guide you in your uh, uh, instant by instant actions moment by moment this is what i do basically that's why i have also very um, uh, large moments of I'm not sharing too much because I'm working on this. I'm working on on being in the moment, and uh, of course I cannot describe you everything to you that's happening in my own personal life. Um, yet what I'm sharing here with you right now it's a conclusion of all that that I have lived um, in this life. So it represents everything that I I have become in this now. So. Um, um, Coming back to the third dimensional uh, reality, what's taking place, um, it's going to be like, uh, this is a huge military action taking place, basically. We have 17 countries, the alliance coming together, Germany, Spain, uh, many others, I don't know by heart, uh, all of them, Netherlands, um, many others, China, uh, Russia, um, they're all coming together and uh, basically... This is gonna be like the beast rising up, and um, um, they're going to completely dismantle what is not working anymore, and then, then we'll be able to move forward in a in a more peaceful uh, world. Yes, peace. Uh, um, we are working on this internally, but yet there are also around the planet those militaries that are working on it and liberating. The planet so the white hats are working behind the scenes and white hats is not just them it's just also all of us who are working who are sending our prayers this is very powerful work you know yourselves when i when i speak of that who you are and uh, this is my feeling my personal feeling and many times i hear the uh, channels saying that uh, yes you chose this you chose for this, you have this mission, you chose for this mission, remember you chose for this mission. You chose to be on the planet for this mission, to do this mission. Uh, yes, I say I chose for this mission, but none, none 
in disguise. Uh, even God himself, uh, herself, himself, herself is no, no sex in God. It's just, <laughs> just all of all of it. Um, itself, I don't like to say itself. I like to say herself, himself, both mother, father, God, better. <laughs> so um, he, 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 she knew already. Uh, um, he didn't. She didn't. She didn't know. He, she didn't know what uh, is. Uh, um, um, what is how it's gonna play play out, and I believe that uh, the dark ones, call them as you like, they have managed to kick this cow very, very, very far away, much further than they were supposed to. If we take into account the Nazara being created uh, some time ago and how far it, they have managed to kick down the can, and many of us knowing all the banking system how it works and still being being able to kick the can till 2023 wow <laughs> from all the things i work from all the time that i've been working on projects and everything i know many many i know some of people that they have passed away uh, just living behind the projects and not being able to manage and they're working of course on the other side now but when you see that and how how much time did this, did this take to to be there and at the same time, see also how fast this went as well, because this is also a fast evolution, fast process, and how much things are shifting now. I remember in 2012, just leaving everything behind and thinking, okay, this is ascension and I'm going to move forward. But then all these things after one after the other one came and all this darkness starts to appearing. So um, this is to say that, uh, well, we are in it completely now and... Um, and uh, however it's going to look in this next days, uh, this is the end of the end of the end <laughs> of this uh, phase. This is finishing now uh, completely. And it's up to each one of us to really um, choose to reset ourselves and to be the uh, creators of our own reality and to focus on feeling good, on feeling more than fine within and doing the work and then creating our own reality and our own lives in our own terms. And this is including everything, our finances, including uh, um, our partners in life, um, our friends, uh, the communities we want to live in, uh, um, the galactic friends we're going to be able to connect with. This is including everything I'm sharing here with you. There is like so much possibilities opening up now. And uh, this is more than ever the time to really go allow the energies basically because we have asked. We have asked all you wanted, and this is what I'm basically to share in this in this uh, um, vlog. To this is the time to basically um, allow the energies to uh, to receive this uh, what the energies bring in to, and then then and then um, experience the manifestation we want to experience. Because when we have asked, it's given already, um, completely and unconditionally. Directly, anything we ask, anything we want is given. From the first time we ask, it is given. We have we have prayed once, and then the rest of the time is about being grateful that we have already received. So many people, <laughs> I see them uh, often uh, on on uh, social media. I pray, I pray, I pray, I pray, I pray. Let us pray, 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 and it's like. It's like you pray, you pray, you pray, and you uh, you never believe actually that you have already received what you ask or asked for the, in the very first time. And um, I say, <laughs> pray once and uh, and be grateful for the rest because we have already received. And it's just about and understanding that this is all about energy work, and the energy work is happening within. So um, um, so this is the time right now to to uh, uh, receive uh, the energies more than ever. And uh, this you can do by going within in meditation, at least 15 to 20 minutes every day or more if you can. And then walking in forest and being in nature and doing a more energy work and doing some yoga and dancing and all these practices that are there to your heart, uh, create more um, of your music maybe or create art, paint, uh, play with your animals and play with children all these things are uh, helping to raise your vibration and to be 
to be in a receiving mode. So uh, this is the message. Um, the message is do your best to be in the receiving mode. This is the final message. And um, whatever you see out there is going to have to play out uh, the way it plays out and the speed that it plays out. It's my sense that it's going to go very fast now. So uh, finishing with what I'm started, with what I started, emergency uh, broadcast system. It's uh, now being tested in UK, and uh, this means something that most probably is going to happen also in other places uh, worldwide. So now this, be ready and uh, stay in receiving mode. High vibes and much love.